guys today. I hope you're having a wonderful Friday. Um, I am home. I just have been having to rest. I had my uh, procedure yesterday. We finally figured out some of what's going on. If you're curious, um, on Saturday morning, I will be uploading my vlog. There's information on that in the vlog. Also, I was just putting together this little goodie right here. This is a giveaway, which will be coming in. Actually, my vlog's going up Sunday, but on Saturday, I have a collab with a friend here on YouTube, and this goodie is for that. So you're gonna wanna check back in both on Saturday to see the collab video and find out what's in that bag and how you can win it. Um, and then on Sunday, I will post my weekly vlog. Um, today, however, we are doing a Stitch Fix box. So um, I'm excited about this box too. Now I did switch stylus this time just because I was getting okay items but the price point for me was a little bit high. And while I love Stitch Fix, sometimes you do run into that the prices can be high. But I got a new stylus. I took a peek on the app and I specifically asked, I said, you know, this happens constantly where I have my price point set with Stitch Fix, but then they just keep creeping up and up and up and up. If I'm going to keep doing it, I prefer to have a stylus that can stay within what I've asked for, for my price points. Even if you don't have something I'm asking for in my price point, that's okay. Tell me you don't have it and get something, give me something else in my price point. So I got a new stylist and it looks like she did some things in my price point and I got real specific with my price point and said I want boxes that are under $200 after the discount. Um, so that, you know, that I got very specific even though I have my items set at the cheapest price for every, every one. At one point I had them higher but um, right now I need them lower. So so Stitch Fix is um, $20 to get a box. If you use my link, you will get a free box. You'll get $25 credit and I get $25 credit. And what I'm really excited about with this box is a bunch of you have used my link. I think I have $125 or $150 credit. I don't think it's gonna be reflected on here because some of it came in late. So I just wanna give a big mwah to those of you that have used my link. That helps me so much. You don't even know, you really don't know. Having an unboxing channel is expensive and I am a single mom and it's been and Robert is a contractor and we're not married he doesn't have a lot of financial responsibilities over here he does help but recently he's had a setback too so um, anyway I just want to tell you guys it's so much appreciated it is so much appreciated um, so I will have my link below if you guys want to use it and get $25 off and you'll be giving me $25 love you <laughs> you get a mailer to send anything back that doesn't fit or you just don't like for free Oh, I don't know that I knew that. Oh, yes, I did. Okay, yeah, I got a shoe bag. Oh, and I'm excited about these shoes. Um, I saw these shoes, and I'm super excited about them. So we got a shoe bag. I have an extra. And we have our bundle. So all these goodies from Stitch Fix we're going to get into. So let me put my box down, move this down here so we have room on my desk. Let's start with my extra. I think these are PJs um, and I think they were around $42. You know what? I don't have prices. She did send me an email stating that they forgot to put my card and my letter in and my price sheet in and she emailed them to me. So I'm just going to show you everything right now and then I'll go to the email after the try on and when we do the recap, I'll tell you the prices of everything. So you won't know the prices till the end when we're recapping, but I have to go back in um, after I'm done with the video and pull that information. So I don't have the card. Um, somehow it didn't make it in my box. So these, oh, these are cute. So these are PJs and they're little summer PJs and they are little shorts. I'm probably not gonna try these on just because these are really, really short shorts. Um, I will try them on, just not for the camera. And um, here's the top, oops. So they're pink with a navy navy piping and it looks like a little, a little navy star there. And these are called, in case you're wondering, Seeing Stars Short Sleeve Pajama Set. What does that say? It's just saying you got to return them together um, but yes yeah, so it's called seeing stars and it's again got the leather or the um, navy piping around the sleeves and the top and the buttons these are so cute these are so cute um, I can see myself sort of keeping these I, th I think they're gonna be really nice so um, I'm excited to try those on see how they fit 
Um, I get hot at night sometimes, and so I like to have shorts to sleep in at nighttime. Um, Robert is like a furnace. He's so hot, he warms the whole bed up, and I just need to have something that I can cool down sometimes. And then I have like hot flashes and stuff, so fun. All right, so we're gonna go into the shoe bag, and if you keep the shoes, you get to keep the shoe bag. Um, you can use these shoe bags for so many things, but they're fantastic for travel. Oh, these are report footwear in a size seven and a half in this beautiful coral color. Let me get the other one out. It's a little smushed, I think, just from being in here. Um, that'll fix when I try them on. I'll try the outfits on with these shoes. I have actually a pair of, um, on my feet right now, of um, last year's sandals from Stitch Fix, and they're great this year too. I've been wearing them all summer. Um, so here they are, and they've got sort of the espadrille type of a wedge. Very cute. They've got, you know, it's brown rubber down here and then the um, straw and the beautiful coral. These are so beautiful. Oh, I'm so excited to try those on. Again, guys, those are from Report Footwear. Let me see if it tells me what the style is for you guys. Draper Wedge in Coral, okay? All right, so now we're getting to our bundle. I think I might go live today too. I'm gonna to see how far I get with my with my videos today. I might end up doing a quick pop-in live. All right, what are these? These are size 29 tinsel pants. I think these were, are they crop kick flares or something? Um, and they've got pockets. Okay, so these are the tinsel Ivana crop kick, fair, kick flare pant, black size eight. And they've got cute little um, zippers here, two buttons here, and then they come down and they're gonna be a crop and a flare. I don't know how I'm gonna like that. Um, I don't know on a short person if this is gonna look good. We'll find out and we'll see what we think. Um, black's a terrible color for my, <laughs> so bad for my house with all the animals, but with the, um, but for work I wear a lot of black pants. So if those work, that would be fantastic. All right, so next again, size 29. These are the Elise, Elise short mid-rise curvy uh, jean shorts. What does this say? Eliminates muffin top. <laughs> it has a little muffin on it. How funny is that? All right, so let's see. These are um, in indigo, and they are the Elise short. These are cute. These are a cute pair of shorts. They might be too short, so we'll see how they do, but they're really adorable. There's the back. So it's got kind of a lighter stitching, little bit of distressing. I actually really like these. These are really cute. I like the stitching up here and down the sides. So I asked for at least a five and a half inch seam, um, inseam. It says three and a half inches. So that is not five inches. So that's probably gonna be too short for me, but we'll try and we'll see. All right, the next thing I, I saw in the preview, and I don't wear this color often because I wasn't sure it looked good on me. Everybody's wearing it, it's getting very, very popular, and I saw this and thought, well, this could be really cute for fall. This is a work top with navy flowers. It looks like it has, what's going on here? Um, yeah, it's got the cross front, so it kind of looks like it already has like a tucked in feel in the front. It's got a V-neck, which I like. This is by West Key. And then it's got tabbed sleeves with, and the little buttons are like mother of pearl. They're all pretty little buttons on there. And then the back just sort of has a pleated back and it's a little bit longer. So the, this is really cute. And I have a pair of navy slacks. Um, I might just try these on with my jeans that I have on instead of the shorts. Um, we'll probably start the try on with that. And um, but this is pretty. So this is by West Key. Let's see what else it says. It's Allen Roll Tab High Low Blouse in Mustard Size Medium. So we'll see how I how I look in this. Let's hold it up to my skin and see. Um, so I don't know that mustard normally would work, but I think because this has the blue, it really pulls the blue in my eyes. I think this might work. So we'll try that on. Let's see. 
And the last item of clothing I got is red, which I really like red. This is by Fun to Fun in a size medium. Zahari split neck blouse. This is a pretty blouse. Again, a cute little work top. And look at this little, I don't know, this really neat detail on it. Can you see that? It's got a crosses here on the sleeves and it's got like a crochet little flowery type of crochet. It's really pretty, a flower, a crochet little flowery type crochet. Yeah, Terry, get your words straight. <laughs> All right, so and then it's got like white and pink flowers and it just comes down again. It's got the V-neck and it has a seam going all the way down the front. This is a cute top. So I don't know how, if you can see that it's sort of pink and white flowers in there, the light, light, light pink. Um, I think this is gonna be cute. I'm excited to try that on too. That does not match my earrings. So I might put a, um, I might go ahead and try things on, just change my earrings and put a neutral um, gold or silver earring on. And we're gonna get trying these on. I'll try that mustard top just with my jeans and shoes I have on now. Um, yeah, so hang tight. I'm gonna show you all the items. We're gonna try it on in the living room in the other room. Did a little cleaning in there. You're gonna see I've got some candles going on my fireplace and stuff, so I'll try not to set myself on fire. The other day I was, um, oh my gosh, I can't believe I did this. I had a three wick candle and I was trying to plug something in and I was bending down to plug it in. All of a sudden I look, I see my hair's on fire, a little flame. I'm like, oh, and I just grabbed it and snuffed it out. But I mean, it, it definitely, I had just gotten my hair cut too. I don't, I think it was like up here or something right here. I think this little piece caught on fire on my hair. Everybody was laughing, but that could have been seriously really bad. So um, let's get on with this try on. I'll be right. Okay guys, I think I actually like this buster top. Um, and I really think that the blue in it is what makes it work for me. I think it pulls out the blue in my eyes. Um, there's a lot of sunlight coming in the back door, so excuse that. But here we are, we have the roll sleeves, which I kind of left them down because you could roll them up, but I feel like they just sort of fall anyway when you roll these. So I just like kind of leave them the way that they are. Um, when I first put this on, it did look like it was gonna show like, like if you bend over like in here, um, it's pretty loose, so you may want to just for safety purposes wear something under it, but um, it does have like a little tiny bit of an elastic here and it comes down in the back a little bit. And overall, I think it's really quite cute. I have it on with those Spanx leggings I got in my trend scent, and I'm wearing um, some old shoes from Stitch Fix from last year. Let me pull you guys up so you can see me all in one shot. You're gonna see the puppies back there too. So there it is. I like it. I think it's actually very pretty for the fall. I think it's one of the few mustard colors that works on me. So I think this one might be a keeper. We'll just need to look at the price and see how much everything is, but overall I think this is quite cute. You guys like this? Okay, so now I am gonna get into the shorts and the other shirts that we got and get out of my jeans. Um, and I am also going to put the other shoes on that are coral. Now they're not gonna go with everything. They might go with that red because of the light pink in there, we'll see. I might just keep them on through the whole try on just so, so that you guys can see all the outfits and I don't have to keep changing shoes. So um, hang tight, it's coming right up. Okay, excuse the fact that I have a dark bra on when I back up, you're gonna see that. Um, I put the kick flare pants on. Look at how cute these shoulders are with that. Like, I love it with the little design on it. Yesterday, um, I don't know if you guys are gonna be able to see this or not, I had a blood pressure cuff on for my procedure. Look what it did to my arm. It, I have broken blood vessels all over my arm from it. So, um, all right, so this is a really nice length. I'm gonna show it to you untucked, then we're gonna tuck it in. I don't know about these pants. They fit fine, they're size eight, and I was worried if like size eight was gonna fit or size 10 was gonna be better, so they fit really good. I, what I'm not sure about is the bottom. They're like a kick flare right at my ankle, and I think they might look a little bit weird. Um, oh, and I forgot to put the shoes on, so we'll do that in a minute, but um, here it is. So the shirt's good. It's like a good length in the back. It's like a little bit of a stretchy material. And 
it fits nicely. I like how it fits. It's comfortable, just needs a different color bra. Like I got nude bras, that's probably gonna be the best bra. It's, it, obviously it's a very thin material and it's slightly see-through, so we'll need to fix that. But overall, the top looks really pretty and I do like the bright, fun color for the summer. And red for the summer is good too. So this is again, one of those items that will transition for me into the fall. I have um, a new Barefoot Dreams cardigan and an oatmeal color that I think will be very pretty with this for the fall um, that you guys will see in my next Nordstrom haul. And I also, that black blazer I kept from Trendsend, I think would be really cute with this as well. But let's back up and show you guys these pants. This is where I need your help. So they're like a little bit of a kick flare. Let's try those shoes on. Let me just show you how they fit. They fit, I mean, we even got a little bit of room back here. So they fit nice in the waist. They fit good everywhere actually. I just don't know how they look. Because sometimes I think these kind of, sh these kind of pants look like floods on me. So hold on, I'm gonna show you these shoes. Okay, I didn't move you guys up because now I'm like five inches taller. Um, so I really don't know about these. I really need help with your, your, with your opinions on these pants because if I keep the pants, they're a five for five. Um, I really like the shoes. I like everything. So these are, I, I still have to try the shorts on. So if the pants and the shorts don't fit, then I just might keep the shoes, this top and the mustard top and keep three. Um, but here it is. And here are the shoes. The shoes are adorable. The shoes are really cute actually. So, I don't know if you can see how the kick flare is. I don't know. I'm not sure about these guys. I need some help. Okay, you guys gotta help me out on those. I'm gonna keep the shoes on. We're gonna try the shorts on next. Okay, um, I have the shorts on. They are short and they're too big. They're a size eight, so this brand must just run really big. Um, they're big in the waist, like massively big in the waist. I'm gonna show you. So, I don't know if you guys can see it. I mean, they're huge, huge. They're huge in the waist. I have so much extra room. So I just tucked the shirt in so you guys can see the shorts. I mean, they're cute. They're definitely cute, but they are short, shorter than I would want them. I'd want them like a, like another inch, at least like four and a half inches. And they're really big. Like I'm gonna definitely need to size down if I'm gonna keep these because these, it's so much room back here. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's so much room that I will be pulling these up all day long. So um, if I keep these, I'm gonna have to size down, I guess to a size six in these. I didn't lose weight. Maybe I lost a couple pounds, but I didn't really lose weight. So they just must run large. So just so you know, I'll go over what the brand of these again, because I don't remember in case you guys get any. So you know, you're probably gonna have to size down in these. They're like so big. Oh my goodness. Like so we can see right down in there. And they are short. So we might not have a five for five. I got a lot of thinking to do after I look at the prices. I remember the prices were good when she sent it to me online, but I can't remember offhand. And it, sometimes it makes sense to keep everything, but I'm not sure I like those those um, pants. And while these are cute, they're a little short, and they're definitely um, they're definitely too big. I mean, they're so big. I'm almost. I wonder if going down one size is, or if they need to go down two sizes. But like, I can't hear. Like here, they're fine. It's, it's just the waist that's way too big it's just way too big so um what do you guys think about these shorts do you think they're worth going down a size to keep them because they are shorter than what i'm comfortable wearing um not by a lot they cover most you know so like most mostly i maybe would just want a little bit more coverage on my thigh but all right all right let's go look at the prices and i will Okay guys, this is one of those boxes where I really need some help and I'm not sure what to do. It, I think what's making it more difficult for me is that I have credit because I don't, if I kept everything including the, the PJs here, um, with my credit I could get the entire lot for 80, $81 for the whole thing. When I separated it out just keeping the two tops, sending everything else back, it cost me zero, but 
I use my credit. I use some of my credit and it leaves me with $70 credit, but I'm sending a couple things back that I sort of like. So let's talk about the different items that we've got and I've got the, the prices here. So let's start with this top here. This is fun to fun Zahari split neck blouse. Um, I did go on the email she sent me and I'll put a picture up here of the blouse um, in case you want to request it in the spelling. I was able to kind of screenshot it and so I'll stick them up here. So this fun to fun blouse is just $38 and I like it. I think it's a very pretty little blouse. I like the added special detail that it has with the crocheting on it and I thought it was a really pretty nice top for work. So this one I'm thinking about keeping, okay? The shorts here, these are the Silver Jeans Company Elise shorts. Again, I'll put something here in the corner. These are 64 and they don't fit. They're um, A, they're, I read my note. I have somebody by the name of Krista G now. Um, she, I specifically asked for at least a five and a half inch seam. She, inseam, she gave me a three and a half inseam. Um, maybe four and a half would have worked. These are a little short on me and they're way too big in the waist and they fit perfectly in the thigh area but just way way too big in the waist there's nowhere those could i could pull them down without uh while they were buttoned i could actually pull them straight down and these are a size eight so these are too big so i'm thinking probably not going to keep these and because they're short i don't think that i'm going to request another size of those okay so then these here are the um tinsel ivana crop kick flare pant um they're already picking up lint and stuff so i'm gonna have to lint roll these um these are 48 dollars. that's a great price and they fit really good i just don't know that they looked really good that's more my concern with these is that i'm not sure that this kick flare um was good for me so looks like there's a loose string down here um, so I don't know. Um, what do you guys think about these? These I definitely would like some assistance on. Okay. Then we have the little mustard top. This, this was the West Key one, right? West Key Allen Roll Tab High Low Blouse. This is $42. And I liked this. I thought this was really cute on me and I don't really have much of this color at all. So this would be a unique find for me. Um, and I think it's a good price. And then the wedges um, aren't a bad price either by Refor Report Footwear, the Draper Wedge. These are $60, not very comfortable. Um, I love the color. I think they're really beautiful. They were not comfortable though, and I have a bad ankle. They're very high. I don't know how high that heel is. One, two, Three. It's about a three and a half inch heel, so they don't offer any support and I have bad ankles. So while I like them, I could wear them. I mean, I could wear them to work. I, I don't think I'd wear these out and about because I think they'd aggravate me wearing them throughout the day. I could live without these as pretty as they are. I don't need to keep these. These are $60. So if I keep the two tops, like I said, I can pay zero and I'll still have $70 credit left. I don't know that the pant, either one of the pants are worth me keeping. And if I don't keep the shorts or the pants, I'm not going to keep the wedges because I just, I have a lot of great shoes. I get great shoes from Just Fab. Um, I don't really need any more new shoes. I have a couple pairs coming and what I asked for was actually some black flats and she didn't have any. So she sent these because she said she knew that I like bright colors, um, which I do. I do think these are absolutely gorgeous. They even can match what I'm wearing today. However, I just, I'm, I'm kind of leaning towards keeping just the two tops out of this fix. Love to know your opinions. Let me know what you guys think. Um, I And then if I add in the, the PJs, I can keep those, still pay nothing for the three th three items. Um, and I'd have about $30 or $28, $30 credit left towards my next fix. So definitely want your opinion because um, the PJs are really cute too. And I feel like they'd be comfortable. And I think these would be really cute for vacationing and, and just for home. But I definitely need some help with this one. I'm just conflicted on it. So um, let me know your comments below. If you like these kind of videos, please uh, give me a thumbs up. I hope you'll subscribe. I've got a lot more clothing boxes to do. Love to be friends with you. So if you enjoy uh, me and my style and exploring my style, then consider hitting the subscribe button. That way you will be notified when I upload every time I upload. So you guys have a wonderful rest of your week. Enjoy your weekend and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.